A Geelong woman has become the first person in Australia to receive a new ear through the wonders of 3D printing. It's a replica of the one Colleen Murray lost in an accident as a teenager more than half a century ago. It's been a long 55-year wait for Colleen Murray to have her left ear replaced. <gasps> wow! Seeing it for the first time was overwhelming. <laughs> I hope it's because it's good, not bad. <laughs> That's wonderful. After losing her ear in a car crash, she says the prosthetic now makes her feel complete. I was born with two ears, and I wanted two ears, and you've done it for me. <laughs> OK. Thank you very That's much. That's all right. It's a pleasure. Colleen's lifelike new ear is the first in Australia to be made using 3D printing technology. What we offer with our techniques is a like-for-like 100% reproduction of that patient's own anatomy, which you just can't ask for better than that. The process began with 3D medical imaging of Colleen's head, then by isolating her right ear, technicians at Geelong's Deakin University were able to use data to print a digital mirror image, which became the model for her new prosthetic. Using the 3D printed model prosthesis at the Royal Melbourne Hospital, were then able to create Colleen the perfect ear. A mould was produced for the silicon ear before the final touches were made, preparing Colleen's new body part. Months were spent perfecting the new ear, which snaps magnetically onto titanium stumps surgically implanted into Colleen's head. A piercing for earrings was also on Colleen's wish list. I've had to hide half my face all my life because of it, mm. and now I'm not going to. Brenton Cadd has been making prosthetics for 40 years. The shape is much better, the size is the same and uh, that's all due to the 3D printing. Other body parts are also being printed in what could become a major industry for Australia. We believe as well there's only maybe one or two examples in the world as well, so Australia could physically be leading the world in this capability. Colleen says her new ear will give her a new lease on life and she's now ready to show it off. I'm going to find a good hairdresser and get a really good haircut to suit around the ear. Karen O'Sullivan, 7 News. Remarkable story.